gonna get your next one. A single father to five-year-old Derek. <laughs> 49-year-old Chris Bailey has spent his life off and on on the streets of Stockton. And it's rough when you have nowhere to go. And then sitting at a park in the heat and... For now, Bailey has spent 13 months at the Stockton Shelter for the Homeless. Suffering from physical problems, he survives on $661 a month and is desperate for a permanent, affordable home. A lot of people that um, on fixed incomes with disability, uh, the welfare don't cover nothing, like I said, it's, it's very low for me and him. But there is hope for people like Bailey. Under Governor Newsom's excess land for affordable housing executive order, the state has targeted 110 of 250 acres of San Joaquin County fairground land for development. So what type of housing will go here and at what income levels? The state says that will be determined by the community, its stakeholders and its leaders. So this is a significant investment in Stockton. Mayor Kevin Lincoln says 20% of the project will be affordable housing with the rest mixed use. But more than that, he wants it to be what he calls an ecosystem of housing. We know it's going to spawn more uh, economic opportunity in the periphery as well. Uh, and even within that particular location with certain commercial recreational opportunities uh, that could be invested there. It doesn't necessarily specifically address issues of homelessness. But by producing more housing overall, it may alleviate some of the issues and some of the problems that, that we're having. Right now, it's all in the early stages. A developer has to be selected and then community input on what it wants. The timeline for completion still to be determined.